So I remember a, a while ago asking you guys what you want to see from me in more of these talking like videos and some people suggested a Q&A so I decided to open a community um, Q&A thing and overnight I received about 60... 68 plus 1 comments so I felt like this was a good time to kind of just start answering some of these questions and I feel like if this uh, ends up being if this ends up being successful, and by successful I mean like if people like this and they want to keep doing it, then this can be a series. This can be something that we can do uh, after like maybe monthly or every two weeks or something like that. I don't know. It really depends. Because I want to be more active within my community, so I thought maybe this was a good way to start. And don't worry, all the other suggestions have been read and I will think of ways to do them as well. It's just every time I try, it kind of ends up not being good enough for me exactly. Like, I, I kind of just don't end up being satisfied with it. Anyway, uh, I guess it's time to get into the questions. I'm scared. Okay, um, <clears throat> first question as this loads. Why haven't you done a cooking with Kamix video? Fuck. Alright. Well, so far, uh, the reason why I haven't done one, I actually have attempted one before, but the problem was it didn't really come out the way I wanted it to, so I decided to scrap it and do it. I wanted to do it a different time, so it's kind of. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, it, it will happen though. I, I promise. But uh, I, I want it to at least be somewhat half decent. <laughs> Christian Gonzalez asks, which musician artist has inspired you the most? Um, I would want to say TGH. Why Camex? I'm bad with names. So Fagatoid Chaos asks, why do furries exist? So Rednos asks, what Snickers should I get next week? Chocolate or white chocolate? First of all, why are you waiting a whole week to get a Snickers bar? Second of all, why the fuck would you choose white chocolate? Thaisto for... I think that's how you say his name, uh, asks, how do you make your music in a nutshell? This is a tough one, but essentially the bass line, drums, counter melodies, etc, etc, um, is what I mean. How do you come up with them? Well, usually most musicians, they kind of just, it kind of just happens. Like, some people, they're able to just create melodies out of thin air, and there are some who need things like music theory to help them out. Uh, Little DC 11 asks, when did you pick up the saxophone and how long did you or have you been playing? Um, I played the saxophone back in the seventh grade because I got tired of the clarinet and so I decided to switch instruments. But the thing was, I only played it for one year in the seventh grade and I decided to pick it back up not too long ago. What remix are you most proud of? I'm most proud of my Sonic Mania um, Press Garden remix. So I've been obsessed with Synthwave lately and it ended up that I I ended up actually really liking that one. What music theme will you never remix under any circumstance? Huh. Probably anything anime. Because Japanese copyright laws. What is your favorite film? You know, the funny thing is, I don't really watch movies all that much. But fuck, man. Uh, mean Creek was pretty cool. Birch to Terabithia was also pretty cool. Are there any under other instruments that you would like to learn? If so, why and what would you like to learn on them? Um, well, basically, I have this lifetime goal to own a lot of instruments, as many as I possibly can, because, well, I just like music that much that I just want to buy every instrument and be able to play them. If there is an instrument that I really would like to learn, it's the violin, because I've always wanted to learn the violin ever since I was a kid, what is your favorite video game? Okay, so I want to say Jack and Daxter the Precursor Legacy because that was part of my childhood. I could 100% that game over and over again and not get tired. But um, Mario 64 is a good contender. Oi Kamex, my, fir uh, my first is when are you going to stream again? My second is how is life so far? Okay, bye. Okay, so uh, I don't know when I'm going to stream, stream again. I should probably do that more often. And also life has been... Decent. Uh -huh. Freezing zombie gamer. You can't comment here for some reason. From Discord, wanting me to ask if you would survive the zombie apocalypse. Give me an AR and maybe, maybe I will. Legacy Gaming asks, uh, do you ever listen to your own music in your spare time? 
And, uh, well, yes, I do, actually. Sometimes I would analyze my old stuff to figure out how I should improve or what I've done wrong in the past. And other times, well, um, I do listen to it just, you know, just to listen because uh, when I make a remix or make music in general, I usually create music in the way that basically I mold my music to what type of stuff I like to listen to. Do you own a Nintendo Switch? And yes, I do have a Nintendo Switch. Do you live with Shrek? You calling my mom ugly? Red Ted says, I love you. It's not a question, but I love you anyways. Are you calling my mom fucking ugly? Have you played Chrono Trigger and do you plan to play it? Um, I heard a lot of good things about Chrono Trigger and like hearing really good things to the point where like everyone's saying it's like the best game of all time with the best soundtrack or whatever. I might I might play it. What's your favorite food? Pizza. No question. Pizza. Which game have you had the most fun doing remixes for? Probably Undertale. I mean, it's mostly because the soundtrack was amazing, it gave me a lot to work with, and also the fact that a lot of people enjoyed the Undertale remixes. It was kind of like the height of my YouTube career. Where were you on the night of the 24th? I was at my, my uh, uncle's house. What's your favorite Pokemon? Um, Greninja, not Blastoise. Xbox or PlayStation? Well, I grew up with PlayStation. Xbox is great and all, but the thing is, all the exclusives can be played on PC anyways. If you could have any superpower, what would it be and why? Huh. I think I've been asked this question before, and uh, I gotta say, um, the ability to fly? Where the heck do you get those rad as hell violins, and what do you use for video editing? If you're talking about like, you know, the solo violins that I use, it's actually just SGM, the sound font. But if you're talking like backup strings, I use cinematic strings, oftentimes. Um, other times I use uh, Orchestral Companion, which I found for a buck in uh, on sale but now they're usually they usually go by a hundred and what do i use for video editing well recently i saw a humble bundle for 20 bucks that included sony vegas yes sony vegas for 20 bucks so i snatched that shit as fast as possible and now i've been using that for video editing which remix was the hardest to make ps what is your favorite pokemon okay so i've already answered the second question but the first question is pretty intriguing which remix was the hardest to make Ah, oh, man, uh, the uh, Primal Dialga remix that I made uh, last year, mixing that song was a nightmare and I didn't exactly know how to make the song sound clear. So I, at some point, I basically just gave up and uploaded it because I was so frustrated with it that, um, yeah, I ended up kind of just giving up on the mixing. But it did end up doing very well and um, it, it kind of reminded me that I shouldn't really be so hard on myself when it comes to making music because sometimes, you know, people won't be as harsh on me as I am on myself. Would you do a lesson on instrument arrangement? Uh, I wouldn't be the best to explain something like that. What sparked your interest in making video game remixes? Well, basically just my love for video game music. Who's your favorite singer slash artist? Oh man. Well, usually I don't actually follow a certain artist for a very long time. Um, it kind of changes depending on the time because I kind of have like phases with uh, music. Are you a furry? So I've always avoided this question because if I answer no, people are going to say that I'm lying and tell me to kill myself anyway. And if I say yes, people are going to tell me to either kill myself or there's going to be some fur fag in my DMs trying to uh, RP with me or something. You can't win. <laughs> when are more albums coming out? Uh, the only problem with albums is the fact that they're kind of expensive to license, so I kind of stray away from them for now because I don't know if there are a dedicated amount of people that were that are willing to buy the albums. So it's really more of a is it worth the investment type of thing. Hey Kamek, so what brought you to the idea of making music and uploading them to the internet back when you started? Also, do you have those phases where you just can't or don't want to make music because of too much failures or something like that? And yes, uh, answering your second question first, yes, there were times where I basically feel like everything I've made sounded like shit, and that happens a lot more often than you think, actually. But, um, you know, sometimes you just gotta keep forcing yourself to do it, and keep going and keep going, and at some point you will like something that you make. It really goes with drawing as well. It's all about force. 
And your first question was, uh, what brought me to the idea of making music and uploading it? it I was kind of just passion, really. It was just something that I wanted to do. What's your favorite color? And what is your favorite season? My favorite color is blue, and my favorite season is... Probably winter. Because summer sucks down here in Florida. Okay, um, I think that's all of the questions. Thank you guys for asking me such great questions. And hopefully we'll do this another time. Um, I actually had a lot of fun answering your questions. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for interacting with me. And I'll see you in the next community post.